When I left Stillwater for the Senate, I vowed never to forget my hometown roots. My husband gave his life defending Stillwater from gang violence. It is my greatest privilege to honor him with this bridge. What the... Spot boys. Whoever this crew is, they flow pretty damn good. They're kill Ben's thugs. Kill who? He's the Syndicate's attack dog. What he did to Johnny's funeral. That's over the fucking limit. He doesn't care about rules of engagement. Uh, no rules? I can work with that. You're not ready to fight the Syndicate. Watch us. Just relax, Shandy. All right, big man, what do you got? There are others who hate the Syndicate as much as you do. I will take you to them. Can you believe this? On my husband's bridge! No, 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 I will not come down. I am heading back to the hill. Book an emergency session. God damn it, this is war! Welcome to Act 2 of the Saints Row the Third. Ah, that was Johnny Gett's funeral that Hulk Hogan destroyed. Hulk Hogan killed his whole team. Well, he has more lackeys. Don't worry about that. So, you know who we're after? Picking up a girl named Kenzie Kensington. The Deckers are holding her on a barge on the river. What's her deal? Oleg said she was with the FBI. Are you shitting me? Don't stress. She was kicked out. So we're getting a shitty fat. Aw, oh, don't start hating because we're getting a new girl. Are you serious? I'm not saying. I'm just saying. I'm not jealous. Who said jealous? That's all on you, girl? Oh, my God. Yeah, yeah, great sexual tension. What got her kicked out? Oleg didn't give me all the details, but he made it sound like Kenzie was about to out the syndicate, so the Decker set her up for a fall. Ugh. I hope she's worth the hassle. Only one way to find out. You gotta get on that bar. So, this mission is actually one of the more fun, even though it's very simple. Because the point of this mission is to drive to this barge, get onto it, shoot all the guys, and rescue this girl. I handle things a little more differently. <laughs> A little bit more directly. <laughs> yeah, I said, you know what? I'm not gonna deal with this crap. <coughs> he can't handle it. <laughs> just he just about can't. It. He has lost it because he's so enthused. I'm by dying what is over here. Oh, but yeah, you don't need to go and kill any of these guys, to be quite honest. I'm I just so drove my boat right up there. Here's is she the girl. Hot? Um. No. Kind of, in a nerdy way, I guess, maybe. Oh, so she's a nerd. Very much so. Um, that's she's untying. touching her ass that's, right that's now. That's untying, by the way. That's not <laughs> groping. So, that's all you really have to do. You don't have to go in there and shoot everybody. But you can if you want to. Keeping Zemos at safe word. Translation, please. The De Winters are the twin sisters that run prostitution in Steelport. Zemos was their competition, so the sisters locked him up. And Safe Word is just a BDSM club that caters to various acts of perversion. The name comes from... Ho ah, we got it. Mine's Teacup. I'll get her out of here. Have fun at the Gimp Show. Now, Kenzie is kind of a bitch, like you said. Yeah. She is very prone to complaining. She's like, I want what I want now, and you can't really argue about it. 
But I kind of like her character, even just because she's like that ex-FBI, she's kind of cooler than what you would expect most FBI people would be, and she's there to help you hack into your, you know, the other guys' networks and stuff like that, and find out what other people are doing. Where Always nice to have nerds on your side. Exactly, I'm a nerd, so maybe that's why I like her. Oh. Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> but you're now driving to basically a leather and lace sex party kind of thing. Really? Uh, yeah. I'll, I'm gonna let I'm gonna let the opening shot speak for itself. So where do we start looking? <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, and, and as, enjoy. It. He's the one guy's enjoying himself. <laughs> yes, very much so. And so as you come through here, there's just. Tons more of these people. You have to grab the patrons. Now, where do you have to grab them? You have to just grab specific patrons. You grab them. Take me to Zemos, or I'm gonna beat your sorry ass. Oh, oh, yes. I love it. So yeah, I decided I don't really like these people all that much. He he asked for he he wanted to get hit, so I hit him. The, the woman didn't though. I don't care. She was in the room with him. They're both sick and perverse, so they must die. That's exactly the, what I wanted to see, though, when <laughs> you say you're going to hit them. I give you what what they want, you know? That's all there is to it. I, this room scares me. The manager, where is he? I don't know anything. I'm just here for a bachelor party. Damn it. I don't even want to know what's going on in this room, but of course this guy's getting his neck broken. Oh. He's there for a bachelor party. Well, not anymore. He's... Now you're going to be there for a funeral. So this lady came up to me and started hitting me, so I was like, screw she you. She looks like one of the evil women that have been battling you the whole time. Yeah, another scary, scary room. I don't even want to know what that machine <laughs> is. Uh, she keeps fuck? on messing with me. Is this the same woman? Yeah, same woman. But Pierce just shot her, so it's okay. It's done. <laughs> That's why I keep Pierce around, you know? Are those people just crawling around because they're perverted? They're, it's either because they're perverted or because they're scared of the bullets. One of the two. Uh-oh. So Things have gone to shit. These are these are bad guys, obviously. Make sure you kill them. And then, see, they keep coming too. So snap his neck. It's really easy to get inside of this place, but this, this is the manager. The owner's a bitch, right? Yeah. Zemos, where is he? If I say anything, the De Winter sisters will cut me off. Funny, I was thinking of cutting something off too. He's in the pony barn. All right. So, when he says the pony barn, it's pretty much exactly that. It's a... It's a... Really? It's, well, there's no ponies inside the barn. You, you know what? I'm not going to spoil the surprise for you. I'll let you see what's in the pony barn all for yourself. I'm not going to tell you. What are these people even doing here? Because this is a syndicate-owned place. Now... So they're just guards, pretty much. I'm dumb. I don't see that that marker's right there, so I keep going down the <laughs> stairs. I'm like, this is where I need to go. I remember I've done this before, and I'm like... The guy oh, you're holding is like, dude, you're going there's the wrong no, way. There's nothing here. I was like, oh crap, I missed it. So just don't do that. Go up here and start killing these people. Then call it a day. Uh, if I never see this place again, it'll be too soon. Oh, I'm going to have to bathe in hand sanitizer. Don't worry. We'll get a box of that shit. How are we going to find Zemos? Look for the cat in here who isn't excited to be eating a ball gag? Or just look for the guy with a rhinestone Z on his back. Fuck out of here, man. Oh, well, shit, that's convenient. They went this way. Ah, uh, shit. <laughs> we don't got time, Zemos. Mush! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Zach, your expression is priceless. You are now in a pony cart, <laughs> being dragged by Zemos, who has been captive. And has been subject to Ooh. God knows what. And, and more pony carts. And then are more pony carts come out chasing you with guys shooting. Can you shoot the driver? You can the, shoot at the them. Pony? I don't know if they shoot the pony. I don't know if shooting the pony is effective. Uh, but this is just why one is of those he still running? Moments because he has to. Like there's people shooting at you. But go like the other way out of the line of fire. I don't know. Maybe he's like you know he trusts the saints. He trusts them. Sorry about making you, you know, pull us around. This is a rescue, right? <laughs> this ain't some elaborate setup for a gangbang. Why you gotta put that image in my head, bro? 
Oh, I'll go and rescue them. <laughs> I would shake your hands, but them floors were a little sticky, if you know what I'm saying. I'm good. Find a moist towelette or something. Who's up? I found the guy he was talking about. 